Okay, so I missed the direct because I was at work today. But I am starting it now. I haven't looked at my phone or anything. I haven't got on. I refuse to go to my subscriptions. I won't um, go on Twitter. So I know nothing. Please, Nintendo. Please, please don't let me down. Fucking Smash Brothers. Like, we don't have time for this. God, it's Dragon Quest. Just fucking over Dragon Quest. Dun, 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 dun. You know how I know this music? Because they play it so goddamn much. these other Dragon Quest protagonist cons. Motherfucking Dragon Ball Z powers. Okay, bitch. It is summer 2019. What do you mean? Okay, enough fucking Dragon Quest! Shut up. No, bitch. Hello, everyone. I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi from Nintendo. In this Nintendo Direct for E3 2019, we'll showcase a variety of games, many of them coming soon. But before we dig into the next game, there is someone I'd like to introduce first. <laughs> what? 
What are you doing here? Wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute. There's been a bit of a mix-up. You're not the right Bowser. Sorry, but I'm the right Bowser for this presentation. Not this way. No, no. This way. Bye-bye. Maybe next time. Are you related? No, but we get that a lot. Well, let's get back to it. Please, take it away. Hi, everyone. I'm Doug Bowser from Nintendo of America, and I'm thrilled to join you for today's Nintendo Direct. This is our chance to show the world we have games for every type of player on Nintendo Switch. Whether you love action, RPGs, or you're just looking for something new, we've got you covered. Okay, so let's get a look at one of those games by taking a tour of Luigi's Mansion 3. Fucking synchronization dance. Or presentation. Mario. How are you calling for Mario again, bitch? You done saved his ass. Mario, Peach, and the others. Oh, lucky him. Luigi's Mansion 3. This hotel is much more than meets the eye. For not long after Luigi arrives, things take a dark turn. We begin our tour by taking in some sights and sounds. You may never leave. You want to leave. The other guests certainly don't plan to move on. They're ghosts after all, and they're rather aggressive. Simply scare them with the straw bulb. Suck them up. Luigi's new Poltergust G00 has the powerful suction capabilities required and other new features as well. First, the slam. While trapping a ghost, slam it on the ground to inflict some damage. It helps to get other ghosts in on the action. Next, the suction shot. Find the plunger to attach it to something, then pull the string and you can destroy furniture and more. It's effective against certain ghost types too. Sometimes ghosts may feel inclined to gang up on you. In such situations, a burst should do. The powerful air pressure released will blow away ghosts, and it's perfect for when you need a little air. Ah, we simply can't overlook the latest invention from Professor Egad, namely Gooigi. Change between Luigi and Gooigi to use both their skills. Gooigi can do everything from slipping through metal fences to walking on spikes. Indeed, okay. the obstacle's too great for Luigi to handle on his own. And if you pass a Joy-Con controller to a friend, he makes for a great co-op partner. But proceed with caution. Gooigi and water definitely don't mix. Now, please direct your attention to the Scare Scraper. Spooky? Sure. Yet it also houses up to eight players for local or online co-op gameplay. Defeat all ghosts before time runs out. Seek and find our dear misplaced toads. And face any challenges the tower throws at you together. place to wake up in, a haunted hotel with floor after floor of oddities. Many traps and mischievous ghosts lurk within. What will befall our missing Mario and friends and his dear brother Luigi? Their fate rests in your hands. Luigi's Mansion 3. Bitch, you're supposed to tell us when. So that was Luigi's Mansion 3, the latest game in a series that I personally love. 
and we can look forward to seeing some of the new gameplay elements that await in this strange hotel as we dive deeper into this title on Nintendo Treehouse, live at E3 2019. We'll be streaming content, some you've never seen before, right from the show floor, including live gameplay of Super Mario Maker 2. And on day three, our Treehouse staff will get their hands on some promising indie games that are new to Nintendo Switch. While you watch today's Nintendo Direct, keep an eye out for this icon to learn what other games will appear on Nintendo Treehouse, live at E3 2019. You won't want to miss it, or this. Have a look. Ogre slept too long. Far too long. <laughs> Sing me your story. What has become of... Oh! <gasps> no! What have they done? Avarice unchecked for an age. Evil takes root. Darkness spreads. But from this dark light, brighter than the three suns, they spark to life. Heroes of Thra, strong and brave. Strength and bravery alone will not save Thra. No! Unlock your true potential. Unite as one! Only together can you defeat what is to come. Heroes of Thra. Going to need all the help they can get. Yo, bitch. Waiting on Pikmin and Animal Crossing and Mega Man Legends. Action RPG Trials of Mana is getting a global release on Nintendo Switch. Set destiny in motion with the power of mana. 
Trials of Mana. Fucking Witcher. Let's all agree to meet back at the monastery exactly. Oh my the fucking time. god. A class reunion? You will come, won't you? Years ago, we fought here as classmates. No, it's already been 16 minutes. It's got to be the worst. Fuck. What should we do, teacher? Kill every last one of them. Still, we have no choice but to eliminate those who cling to unreasonable ideas of justice. Someone must put a stop to the cycle of the strong trampling the weak. The soul star consumes even the darkness itself. Yet we have the strength to scale the walls between us, to reach out our hands in friendship so we can open our true hearts to one another. That's how we win! My teacher. Both sides of time are revealed to you. What shall you do? How lovely it would be for this moment to last forever. Nintendo Switch is the only gaming console you can play not only on your TV at home, but anywhere you go. In fact, with a system like this, it might be fun to play Resident Evil at a location like this. Something happened. Okay. What is the point of this? Resident Evil. 
Bueno. Playing a Resident Evil game in a place like that might not be my way to play, but... I bet you could find your way to play, don't you think? For now, please take a look. Was today the 4th of July? If not, is the Empire striking back or what? Looks like things are gonna get weird today. Hey, she! What is that? Eat real quick. There's probably some planet-eating type dude waiting for me up ahead. All yoked and powerful and trying to take over the world or something. Why does this seem familiar? Hero descends. What? There are no heroes in this world? Oh, but there totally are. My name is Travis Touchdown. I'm the last hero around, here to save the world. I'm also just a passing assassin. Fucking no more heroes. Start the game. Fuck off. Welcome back, Travis, to the Garden of Madness. led an elite team of Contras during the war. Hungry Beast! HB is actually a cyborg. I love him so much. This is Miss Harakiri and her alien gut bucket. They survived by merging together during the alien wars. The gentleman, the sweetest bug you'll ever meet. You soiled my arm! Oh, that did not look good. Like the people on the ground. Fucking Dragon Quest again.
Konnichiwa. Hello. I'm Shinya Takahashi from Nintendo. Earlier this month, we held a Pokemon Direct for the latest games in the series, Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. The developers from Game Freak showcased the new Galar region, the location of your new adventure, and some new Pokemon you will <gasps> Baby babies! It will be a while until these games launch, so please stay tuned. By the way, in these games, you can use certain functions of the Pokeball Plus accessory, allowing you to take a Pokemon from one of these games out for a stroll through the real world with you. You may not be able to use the device as a game controller, but if you spend some quality time with a favorite Pokemon of yours, then something good might happen. In the Nintendo booth at this year's E3, fans can play Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield for the first time anywhere in the world. In this gameplay demo, you can challenge one of the gyms in the Galar region, the one and only Water Gym, where the water type gym leader Nessa. Yeah, people are gonna love her. If you're attending this year's show, I encourage you to experience a battle between Dynamax Pokemon, which is an advanced strategy from this region. Also, immediately after this Nintendo Direct, stay tuned for live gameplay of Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield on Nintendo Treehouse Live. Oh, really? And now, I'd like to shift gears. Please have a look at this. Please let it be Animal Crossing. Astral Chain. Yes, bitch. I've been waiting for you. As you know, Earth is currently under extra-dimensional attack. Chimeras. Like the ones you've just seen for the first time. At this rate, all of humankind will be pulled into the Chimera's dimension. We're facing down the end of the world. Through blood, sweat, and years of research, we finally made it. The ultimate counter-Chimeric weapon. By neurologically syncing captured chimeras with human operators, we established control and made powerful allies. I'm referring, of course, to the legions. I'll give you some parting advice. Your power, it's not the blessing you think it is. When a legionis and a legion are perfectly synchronized, it's like they're two parts of one body. No use! The override release isn't going through! That's impossible! And when half of that body is about to die, the Legion's survival instincts kick in to save it. No way! There's no way! What good could this possibly be? It's a long shot, but it's the only shot we have! It's all up to you, my friend. A blessing from the Legion. Or maybe I should say, a curse. We can't, can't turn, turn back, back now. now. I've got to know the whole truth. truth. He's, He's still, still alive, alive out there. there. I know he is. is. Death by our hands is not an honor they have earned. They deserve something 
much worse. Even with this stone at my command, this may not be a battle we can win. Whatever's happening, we can beat it. Keep fighting! Jump in any time now, darlings. They will pay for what they've done. In blood. All hope is fleeting in the face of Thanos. Well, that frame rate was awful, if you saw. Because I saw it. Come the fuck on. Animal Crossing and fucking Mega Man Legends. So, what do you think so far? Now for some follow-up information on a game that fans have been waiting for. Please take a look. Please tell me it's fucking Animal Crossing. Your attention, please. The Nook Inc. getaway <gasps> will soon be arriving at the deserted island.
Originally, we announced this title as a 2019 release. However, we need to change its release date to March 20th of 2020. To ensure that the game is the best it can be, we must ask you to wait a little longer than we thought. We hope you look forward to the latest installment of Animal Crossing. Where's Pikmin? No. On Nintendo Treehouse Live, the game's producer, Mr. Nogami, and the director, Ms. Kyogoku, will come on for a live demonstration of some early moments in the game, so please stick around until it starts. By the way, there are many different types of games coming to Nintendo Switch from Nintendo and our partners. So, we've prepared a highlight reel to show you what's in store for 2019 and beyond. Let's have a look! Pikmin 4, Mega Man Legends. Oh yeah, Wolfenstein. How in the fuck is that gonna run on the Switch? Oh my god. Okay, it's probably like the 30 more, 20, 15 more seconds of... Please not another fucking like Donkey Kong tropical f <laughs> That's not fucking funny. Wait, if Nintendo can use Banjo-Kazooie in the thing, that means Microsoft might let them use or take over the new IP. Wait, what? Why would you do us so dirty like that? 
and make us think another banjo kazooie's coming out. That obviously wasn't Duck Hunt Silhouette, was it? Please stay tuned for more information about DLC in the future. As for Nintendo Switch, we have more games in development beyond what we've shown you today. I'm looking forward to the day we can introduce them to you. Speaking of, before we end this direct, I actually have one more thing to show you. Oh God! Thank you very much for watching. What is the one more thing? What the fuck is that? Well, this isn't mother fucking Mega Man. Like a new Zelda game already? already. If this is just addition to Breath of the Wild, I'm gonna walk the fuck out this room. Wow, fuck off. And they spent their time on that instead of making Mega Man Legends. Capcom is responsible for that, not Nintendo. They're the hey, one good morning, fucking everybody, and welcome to E3 2019. Michael. I'm Doug Bowser from Nintendo of America. Do you not understand how things Nintendo work? Like Nintendo's going to be the one to release a Mega Man Legends movie. game. Nobody else. We're talking about what we just saw in that Nintendo Direct, and we're going to give you a sneak peek of the booth. People were expecting so there to be a Mega Man Legends you, announcement a at well, Nintendo. People were expecting fucking like a lot of things. And goes without question. And and I myself, am a huge fan of the Legends. only thing they showed was Animal Crossing and. That they postponed the date for that as well. So. Okay, but they should have. But once again, I get to walk away from E3. Fucking just.